Hello and welcome back to Let's Play The Witcher 2 Assassins of Kings. We, the last time we came along, Geralt was, saw the big monster. It ran away. Go ask the mason to take you as his apprentice. Ooh, You'll learn a trade. Hello, Blue Dot. King. Igor. Ever seen the river monster, the Karen? I have, but I'm not the talkative kind. Oh. Speak up. A monster's as big as a barn, with giant tentacles. Snatches men from boat nets and cattle off the shore. It's slimy like a snail, but fast as a thirsty vampire. Ah. That's a nice bit of info we just picked up. Thank you very much. And you weren't the talkative type. Yeah, we, yeah, sneaky devil, you. I'm sure you've got a tale or two for me. Well, you guys look certainly carefully. You sound a boat with a Kraken monster thingy down in the water. You guys are useless. You're interesting. Why are you down there? Good day. Why are you people down here? What's white haired one? I have another I figure. have an offer for you. Greetings, white haired one. Why was think? I could do with your help. You see, I'm looking for a certain formula. I'm no herbalist. No. I know who I kill you things. are. I'll be straight. Find the formula and you'll earn a sizable pouch of orans. Okay, I'll agree to that. I can betray you later. Sounds good. What do you want me to do? The formula is in the hands of a certain shopkeeper. Can't go and see him yourself? He deals in incense. One type is particularly... Popular. Popular. I think what he sells is harmful, yet I need the formula to prove it. The scoundrel knows that and is very cautious. Yet I assume you, as a witcher, have your ways? I'll uh, see what I can do. Okay, that's a, a poisonous incense. You might sell to a witcher, because you know, a witcher likes these things and we, we tend to need them. Ah, uh, blue dot here. Witcher! People! The mutant's pursuing me! Now the mutant came to flipping will talk to you about your bloody offer, you. You're. Ooh, I'm just gonna rob you blind of a steal of you. I think the stew's ready. Quiet woman. Artist at work. He might want to stir it. No offense, but uh, you're scaring my customers away. Uh, I can set things alight and put them all down, mate. Uh, I know what shop merchants on about as well, so let's pop over here, we know who's on about. Alright, so, a shop merchant, he says, could be selling something that's poisonous. A fine mess you have here. Dwarves yes. stealing bread from the God mouths of a craftsmen. Are you a witcher? I am. You've yes. got to do something about that filthy business. The crook selling the poison is going unpunished. I think he's just selling incense. Incense uh -huh. is only a cover. People get addicted to it, lose their senses. It's like this tech. You must shut down that shop. Close the shop and the citizens of Flotsam will reward you handsomely. I'll talk to the trader. Okay, new quest phase. Uh, Oh wait, that's the wrong button, no one. Oh, back out. More on that one, that one. Little Shop of Dreams. So let's see, the Fox Woman is the town square, the old mates of inhabitants possessing shopkeeper for selling dangerous dubious herbs. Which in herbalists always meet aversion, but in this case it turns out a little differently. The leader has for Gallop to make the shopkeeper close his business. The scent of incense. Uh huh. Well, they both want things, so I want the incense, so, uh. 
I want you. Don't make me become very hostile with you. Welcome to my modest shop. Okay. I need one of your incense formulae. I've got more than 200 here. I'm interested in the best seller. Someone's offering a handsome price for that formula. They say it's harmful. Impossible. I haven't had a single complaint. Uh -huh. And I'll not give the formula to anyone. How about this? I give you a formula for a similar scent. You get your reward and I keep my secret. Ah, uh, through this one the hard way. If I don't get the real formula by the count of five, you'll be greeting one of the two friends I carry on my back. One. Two. Wait, wait a minute. Uh, maybe <laughs> we can come to an agreement. Three. Three. All right, wait. I'll give it to you. Here. Happy? Yes. Thank you. Real formula. Are you selling drugs? They say one of your scents is a strong drug. A drug? Here. Never heard such nonsense. A lady told me it works just like Fistech. Perhaps everything works like Fistech on that lady. Uh, let's try this one. I know there's something unusual about it. All right. I admit it. I've traded in incense for years. It, it was an ordinary scent. How could <laughs> I know it would have such an effect on people? Anyway, I can't ban them from using it. I believe you. You sound honest enough. I should tell them that it doesn't it's an incense thingy, okay. You haven't closed the shop. Peep. No one's forcing them to buy incense. You'd not say that if your own were sniffing it. Get out of here! Yeah, well. I back him up, he may help me in the future. On the other hand, I have given away his most popular. Ah, right, it's in here. Okay, you know? Come on, nearly got oh, then. Wee! Oh, we Down. I'm bored, stiff. What? Smart ass, eh? Greeting. Yes. Welcome. Yes, I am a smart ass, and I can kick all your asses. Just a you know, friendly warning on that one. I am a witcher, and I can kick all you. And I can beat the th not out of you, what in about four and a half half beats. Back in the harbour. There you go. There we go. You free? No, you're not handsome enough. Ah. Uh, I am well handsome. I get so many people. How did it go? Did you get the formula? I have it. Show me. Here it is. Grand. I must check its authenticity in the lab before I can give you your coin. I'm a cautious man. Forgive me. I'm cautious too. Give me back the formula. All right. We'll go together. I'll wait for you by the uh -huh. gate at the market side. We'll go together. Yep. If he double crosses me, I'm going to have to kill him. I don't think he can take me in a fight, because I, I... I swapped out my old blade for this new blade, and this new blade hit harder. Oh, I want to run up there. Let me run your shop, your house windows, your houses. It's true! Faltest is dead! Yes. Flotsam's got a garrison. We don't need a witcher. Yes, you do. I am a witcher. Geralt of Rivia. A Revelon. What's this? Attention, monsters. Oh, that's a flattering picture. Attention, monsters! <laughs> Tell me, do you get much action with that thing? Where might you be going? Uh, what kind of question is that? Anyway, know where I can find an elf named Cedric? Don't get involved in this. The merchants are paying good money for killing the beast. Coin is never the most important thing. Maybe, but it's still pretty useful. 
I don't trust her. Sheila? Why not? She's a powerful sorceress. Dangerous to her foes, even more dangerous to her friends. Uh -huh. I know you don't like her. Any specific reason? Yeah. I'm just trying to warn you. Thanks. I guess I'll have to ask her. How? We're going hunting together. Right after I find Cedric. Well, then let's go see him. He should be at the top of his observation tower. Uh huh. Just Smeagol. Oh wow, there's lots of green dots everywhere. Hello, you. Any work for a witcher? Yeah. Enough work for three. But what of it? We're poor folk. I'm sure we can work something out. Yeah. We best go to Flotsam Town Square near the inn. There are notices on the board there. Just leave the troll be, please, no matter what the townsfolk say. Any other job? Go seek the old man. Cool. Lurido splurged on a sorceress, so he's clearly got means in the budget. What sorceress? What sorceress? You mean Triss Marigold? Lady Sheila de Tanserville. A significant uh -huh. person, but poor as a temple mouse, just like ye. Seems spellcraft and wealth don't go hand in hand. They say she's agreed to kill the old man, so hurry if you want to jump in before her. Go speed. They said, but leave the troll be, no matter what the town folks say. Uh, have to try a log book. No. Hang up. I can. Decent. I want to test the offensive of the to meet with which are on the market side of the gate. Did I actually leave the area it's supposed to be? I think I did. Okay, Tris went down that way. Any other one else? Yeah, Kai and Cedric, Sender. I'll stop. I'll do more of the Kayam. This one with her, because we need to get this all stuff sorted before we can keep going with all things. Oh, get up there. How did you get up there, Chris? I mean, literally, I didn't see you climb. Well, they're all about the troll. I need to go back and check that board if there's any actual contracts for trolls. How did you get up here? In Belk. It'll be nearly a year now. Moril would delight in a day like this, Sir Heron. Enjoy the memory of her. Don't wallow in the long run. I try. I do. <laughs> but I cannot believe all the bad blood this disappearance has bred. Don't let other Shay poison your memory of her. Hatred is but an outlet for helplessness. Thank you, Cedric. Vafail. Vafail. Uh-huh. Cedric is much more um, open-minded than the other elven folk. What? What are you talking about? Welcome. Ah, I want to talk to you. If we're missing, I'm a witcher. I can hunt people are down. You Cedric? Who asks? Geralt of Rivia. Ah, the witcher. And? and Triss Marigold. The sorceress. Lovely scent, Triss. Cedric, look at me. What do you want, Geralt of Rivia? Okay. The elf woman you were talking about. How did she disappear? Sir Harim believes the forest took her. What do you believe? Moril simply vanished. Uh -huh. Almost a year ago now. Some say she was too beautiful, and Dwan must have harmed her. You believe that? If I have no evidence before me, I try to trust my feelings. And they tell me the forest did not take her. Uh -huh. Why would you keep that from Saharan? Because it's meaningless. Perhaps she was murdered, perhaps she departed on her own, never to return. She's gone. And neither I nor Saharan can reverse that. Uh -huh. Cool. I hunt monsters. I'm looking to hunt in this area, and I could use some advice. I'm no witcher. I set traps, snares, try to keep Neckers away from Lobinden. That's all. Mm. 
I'm aiming a little higher than Necker's. The old man? Meaning the Karen? Finally, Laredo's splurged. Listen, I'm not uh, one not to me. teach your grandmothers to suck eggs. You witches know your work. But if you pay me, I can prepare a useful trap. What kind of trap? Puncturing trap, immobilizing trap, even decoys to pull monsters into an ambush. Whatever you like. Since I can easily finish off an ensnared Necker, it should be child's play for you. Uh huh. Let's see if we can talk about um. Oh, craft items for me. That's handy. Some. I need to make a few orans. I'm going to finish this conversation off. I think. For a witcher, would you? Yeah. There's never a shortage of work for a witcher in this forest. Cool. It's positively teeming with beasts. Though I'm not surprised they come here in droves. Know why that is? Yeah, why? Cursed places attract all sorts of scum, like dung attracts flies. There was once a great house in the clearing. They locked up lunatics there. During ah. the war with Nilfgaard, it was raised in a fire. Yep, the lunatics it. broiled in their cells. Yeah, that'll The do ruins it. remain cursed to this day. Two daredevils went off to explore the ruins recently. They haven't been seen since. A great house, you say? Tell me more oh. about the building itself. It was an old manor house that was converted into a mental institution. Nice. There was no shortage of lunatics in wartime. They just kept coming. Reverend Mercey locked them up in there and looked after them. If you find the two people lost in the ruins of the mental asylum, oh. you stand to be handsomely rewarded by them or their families. Excellent. I'll give that a shot. Thank you. No harm in trying. Oh, I also actually finished talking about this. What are the Scoia'tael fighting for? Do uh, you ask about the old ones who hoped to restore our race to its previous glory? Or about the young ones who fight for survival and out of suicidal revenge? Both. Yorvith's warriors. Which mold do they fit? They believe they are still independent and that there is but one just way to view their cause. In truth, However, uh -huh. they're but a shadow of the Enshe's former glory. They cling to delusions to the very moment when a sword or a noose ends their life, or until they realize the truth themselves, which is, I believe, mm. the worst. Okay, so essentially then they are uh, the thought that just... Uh, who exactly are you? I am One who warns humans against the dangers that lurk in the forest. Useful, then. to clarify? I am old. Even for an elf. Yet the forest is older. I've lived in it for years and understand it. Good. Though it's nothing I can explain. At times I make mistakes and people don't come home. So you help humans? I yes. just know if it's safe to venture beyond the gates or not. Cool. Where's my liquor? Are you drunk? Maybe I'll come back when you're sober. You witches live a long life. You may indeed get to see that day. <laughs> I'm drunk most of the time. I aim to kill the Karen. Heard you might be able to help. Yeah. That depends on the sort of aid you seek. I need information. Yep. We should have killed it years ago. Now, now I don't know. The beast has become too large for the riverbed. And it has strange growths on its tentacles, extremely thick skin. Hmm. Previously, it inhabited a swamp along one of the Pontar's tributaries. Completely wild terrain. Even the Scoia'tael don't venture there. You should go see the wreck of the boat it recently sank. Inspect any traces nice. it's left. See the destruction. Where's this wreck? Venture south into the south. forest, okay. then turn uh, east toward the river. East, gotcha. Well, You'll find the ruins of a bridge erected long ago by the Enshe. The wreck lies at their foot. Thanks, Cedric. Okay, we got that done. You'll find me by the boat wreck. Jeez, Triss. Sure you're not overusing those teleports? That's not fair. <laughs> anyway, there we go. I put the... I. I think I managed to put the uh, right address in the set nav. Uh, set nav. Yeah, set nav. It's just. Uh, it's time. Well, they use a Google map, but it's not very really update, update yet. Right. Just end the video. Yes. Anyway, folks, 
that's it for this video. When we come back, we shall venture forth on multiple quests, because it looks like we have a lot of them packed up now. And we will see, and we will hopefully get plenty of loot and plenty of stuff. So until then, folks, until then, I'll catch you all later. See ya.